Do you have to come in here and say you guys are going to get two wins and then actually do it? Mm -hmm. What did it require of your group? Um, our attention to detail, communication, big time, um, effort. Uh, I think we checked all those boxes um, and we got the job done. What would you say about Aaron Gordon's performance tonight and what he was able to get for you guys? Uh, Aaron was big time. I mean, but he's been doing it all year. Um, every playoff series, he's given us, you know, everything across the board. He's checked each stat you can put up. He's guarded the best player. Um, Aaron has been awesome. Where do you think he found his spots tonight offensively? Because he was getting a lot of easy baskets. His teammates are finding him. Well, he did a great job of, you know, playing inside out. Um, I think he got his rhythm by going by getting some easy looks, got some easy layups, got to the free throw line. And I think that led to him knocking down some threes. Um, but he's been playing wonderful. Um, but, you know, one more to go. Jokic gets in foul trouble in the fourth quarter there. Five fouls, heads to the bench. What happened with that group that was in the game from your vantage point that allowed them to really lock in and, and get stops and score? I think most importantly, we started with the defensive end. We got stops. We got on transition. Uh, Bruce made big plays, uh, big, big plays. Uh, Jamal was Jamal. And uh, I think we just stuck with it. We played together. Coach talked about how he allowed Jamal to play off ball a little bit in that fourth quarter and Bruce to kind of take over. The way that he was able to score and create stuff offensively, how important was that in that stretch? Uh, it was huge. It was huge uh, because every time they, Jamal had the ball in his hands, they went to double. Uh, so Bruce uh, stepped up to the plate. Uh, he made some huge shots. Uh, and He led us to the victory. Coach keeps saying you guys haven't done anything yet, but you have an opportunity to go back and win an NBA championship in Denver. What is that going to take, and what does that feel like in this moment? Everything. Everything. Uh, this, this game has, has to be the game that we go out and we just leave it out on the floor uh, like we've been doing. Um, the continued communication, defensive effort has to be there in order for us to come out victorious. Jeff, being one win away from changing history again and getting the first title mm -hmm. for, for Denver, what is it going to take, and uh, how do you keep your composure your right mindset, not celebrate too much, and keep your focus? Well, I think we just understand, you know, what we have to do. Um, we're not going to get ahead of ourselves. We're going to prepare like, you know, you know, this is one step that's going to get to where we need to be, like it is. And, um, you know, going with the mindset that we got to close it out, uh, but we know we got to win each quarter to do that. And Coach was saying trust is a great part of your culture, or the culture of this team. What do you think about tonight that uh, Jamal was trusting everybody with the assists and everything? Uh, I mean, we play together. We play for each other. I've always said that from the beginning, and it, it was showcased tonight. Um, Jamal <laughs> stepped up to the plate, and then, you know, when they started to bliss him and they started to trap him, uh, he trusted his teammate, and Bruce got it done. And what about Aaron Gordon tonight? Can you comment your his performance? Yeah, uh, Aaron was big time the way he played defense, uh, you know, dominating the paint, and then he got going on the, on the outside perimeter, so he was fantastic. What do you think is going to be the key to close it out next game? Just effort, effort, communication, and defense. Thank you.